I'm John Proxy, and I'm about to begin a Demon Souls adventure on the first day. Man was granted a soul, and with it, clarity. On the second day, upon earth was planted an irrevocable poison. A soul, a soul devouring demon. Right, um, so this is episode one. I actually recorded this bit in the last episode as well, but I decided I'd watch it again. Why not? What I've done is I've, uh, I've decided to create a brand new character. I've saved their appearance this time, which I forgot to do in episode zero. Uh, but I'm going for a different class. But, um... And I'll show you. I'm not 100% sure on the appearance, but screw it. We'll, we'll just use it anyway. Otherwise, I'll be there forever. Look at this chap. My bow. So hopefully it's not too fuzzy around me. I've moved the camera recently, so it's now there rather than up there. So my face is level, looks better. But I am looking a little bit orange. Demon Soul! Right, so I'm assuming a lot of people are going to skip the episode zero as well, because it's just me faffing around with character creation and not having a little play with the game. Uh, we're going to press new games. Uh, I don't know how you delete games in this game. Uh, I'm going to go for body type B, but I hopefully have saved a creation. No! Where's my saved creations? I don't understand how this system works. Oh, I made one. I made a... Uh, what does this mean? Like... Oh. Alright, well, I've got one. I'll just redesign it, right? No, I liked it, damn it. Why? So, I thought... Hang on, what does that say? Erection? What are you, what are you doing? Uh, RSN. Set. Right. See, it's not going to look the same now. I wanted... I was going to go for a royalty. Or wizard. A uh, magician, even. They wear the same coat. But damn it, like, because the shape of the face is the thing I can't remember. Ah, uh, but whatever. We can't, I can sort of remember most of it. I'll randomise the other bits. Uh, and I want that ring. We're going to do this quickly. I kind of know... Uh... Sure. Yeah. <laughs> Don't know what the difference is. Right. Uh, I really love the randomised button. Damn it, I didn't want to spend half an hour doing this. I wanted to jump straight into the game. I thought it saved. I swear, like, I made it save in a position. Okay. Well, I don't like that either, but whatever. So what... I will do that at last. So I wanted to have a sort of wizardy look. So I decided to go for that. I know it's silly, but why not be silly, eh? And it was it was red. So he was a royal dude. Okay. From there. Uh that not, might not be so bad actually. So very Japanese this hair. Uh I think it might have even been one of these. Like, a little bit grumpy that it didn't save, but... What are you going to do, eh? What are you going to do? It was a silly design, anyway. Put one of these. 
I know it was bright red. Because why not? Also, I sort of had a plan. Uh, we'll have a look at the other hairs, but... Like, I appreciate this is a girl's hair, but... I can't believe... <laughs> I definitely am not having the Karen haircut emo. Uh, might even have been that. I think it might have been that. Okay. No, for fuck's sake. Because I hadn't, I wasn't. I will do that again. God damn. <laughs> I'm not even in the game yet and it's <laughs> it's being mean to me. I'm not keeping this face. anime character. His face doesn't look very anime that now though, does it? No! For f oh, god damn. Yeah, I will go for okay, I can, I can make him older. I, I, I think I'm just going to give him young. Maybe I should have him be my age. I like that my age is so low down in this. It makes me feel a lot better that it's like this end of the scale. Are you, no 19 year olds are allowed to play. There you go, I'm 35 or 36. I don't know. Um, I'm, I'd have to genuinely check. Uh, if we actually are doing John, then the weight should be heavier. But uh, there we go. I kind of wanted him to look scholarly. Oh yeah, I had, because that's my alarm, tells me to wake up. Yes, I had silly anime eyes, of course I did. This is kind of going to make it, I think, they're, they're kind of bluish. Whatever. Because he was a wizard of some sort. The ears don't really matter, you can't really see them. Oh, why not? That's kind of like my nose. I don't want a small mouth for reasons that'll make sense in a second. I mean, he looks like a real person rather than an idealized wizard, so I guess that's good. Okay. What I was thinking, I don't want those blemishes. 
what I was thinking of doing, I know I did this last time, and that kind of works quite well. Uh, there was actually some makeup, because uh, it looked all wizardy. But I didn't like the lipstick, because it was obviously a lady's makeup. It was this. And like, I wanted a kind of an exotic wizard type thing. Uh, and I appreciate it looks a little bit silly. But, I mean, we're, we're only going to be with this character for like 50 hours. Why not look a little bit silly? So yeah, I'm not super keen on the lipstick, I won't lie. Um, but screw it, why not? Uh, give it a once over again. If we darken it, it might look better. Okay, whatever the age does is super subtle. You know what? I think that's enough. I think we just go with it. We know it looks silly. It's a look. We can put the hammer on if we look feels dumb. Let's just finalize. I don't know if you're supposed to have a full name, but it lets me. Do we really want the ice shadow, John? Yes, it's done. King Alant the Twelfth, by channeling the power of souls, brought unprecedented prosperity to his northern kingdom of Boletaria. That is, until the colorless deep fog swept across the land. Boletaria was cut off from the outside world, and those who dared penetrate the deep fog never returned. But Valifax of the royal twin fangs broke free from the fog and told the world of Boletaria's plight. That the old King Alant had roused the Old One, the great beast below the Nexus, from its eternal slumber. And that a colorless fog had swept in, unleashing terrible demons. The demons, demons are terrible. hunt down men and claim their souls. Those who lose their souls lose also their minds. The mad attack the sane and chaos reigns. Valifax also spoke of the enticing power of the demon souls. Each time a demon claims a human soul, the demon's own soul is invigorated by the life force. And the power of a mature demon soul is beyond human imagination. I can't even imagine it. It's beyond me. Mighty warriors lured by the possibilities braved the fissure to breach the accursed land. But none have returned. The awe of the Twin Fangs. Yet oh, turned. a silent chief. Hasn't returned. Saint Urbane. Hasn't, hasn't returned. Skurva the Wanderer. Hasn't returned. The sick Saint Astria with her knight Gaal Vinland. They ain't returned. And Sage Frake the Visionary. Also, the colorless deep fog slowly creeps beyond Boletaria's borders. Do I have sound? Yes, I do. Lovely. Humankind um. faces a slow and steady extinction. The deep fog will eventually swallow all lands near and far. But wherever they are, has one final hope: a lone warrior who has braved the baneful fog. Oh, has the land found its savior? Or have the demons found a new slave? Ah, oh, it's the first one. It's definitely the first one. There I am. My silly hair! My hair is silly! Is soul who fears not death. I shall guide you to the fissure. There it is. I found it. You don't need to go. So I can see it. The old one back to slumber. I choose royal, right? 
Doesn't really. Oh yeah, the reason I wanted Royal is because Royal's level one as well. Well, there is a bit of green around me. The outpost passage. So, right, first things first. So yeah, so my soul level is one. Uh, let's have a look at my items. What do they do? Consume to reasonably recover HP. Counteracts poison. Okay, cool. Uh, do we have anything else? We, we do. We've got a stone that emits light. Uh, we have a rapier and a silver catalyst. I guess that's for spells. Um, it's my wizard set. Right. So, I don't know what tendency means. But, like, I've got an eyeball. Look at look at how weird I look. I don't know. I immediately regret all the decisions. It's fine. Uh, why didn't I make him look cool instead? I could have at least changed the hair. Why did I make... <laughs> the wizard. I don't know what any of this means. Okay, so we have a spell this time. There's a couple of symbols on the left, I just I have no idea what they mean. R1 is standard attack. There's a help button. Uh, I can string together multiple attacks. Lock on, but he didn't do that. So this rapier is very. I must be facing them. Direction hold. I saw spin last time. I do like that I have a better dodge now. Hello, you ghost. I have that. God. I'm just gonna lock because I don't have to already. Oh, I killed him. I'll win. Lock. Attack. Okay. So far, so good. Being very wary. I did play Dark Souls 3, so but it's not my first rodeo. Dark Souls 2 was my first rodeo. Um, so, I did have a look at performance mode. Look how silly I look. Uh, and I thought, oh, you know, I'm not really an uh, alpha gamer, right? I probably won't even notice the difference between 30 and 60 FPS. Let me just show you, just in case. So in 60 right now, let me just show you what performance mode looks like. A uh, cinematic mode even. Yeah, it looks like I'm going in slow motion. It's really weird. I didn't think I'd notice it. But I totally do. Ah, it's like, it's so weird. Like, it's not... I don't know if it's just because I'm able to like immediately see the difference, but it's night and day. Um, so yeah, we're playing on performance mode. I get to pretend to be a uh, uh, 
you know, a smug kind of, yeah, it's gonna play on cinematic mode, uh, performance mode. So we can try to do a parry, it hasn't taught me a parry yet. Grass, lovely. Use item and switch item. Cool, but I don't want to use item yet. It's square to use item. Can vault over railings. Oh, I don't want to be in there. Get back up there. It hasn't taught me. And now we're turning on to the bridge. And I guess. Doesn't slow me down too much just to keep this up. Oh. Well, into attacking me. With my hair. Okay. Good damage then. But I think I can save. I mean, I think I can heal up. It feels darn sight safer. Took some shots then. Parry. Uh, parry and repot out. Okay, this is going to be a hard one. Oh, I did it straight away. I want to heal. Okay. Huh. 
No, they're limited, but I was nervous. Okay, switch. Yeah, I've done that already. More healing? We've catalyst. Oh, I can change my spell. I've only got one spell, it looks like. How oh, does one. Oh, what rings do I have on? Very good ring. Slowly restore MP over time. Oh, my word, I should be using magic again. See you. Play on easy mode right now because of the magic? Possibly. Well, I have a choice. Yeah, not going for that just yet, am I? <laughs> oh, 
However, the next just traps you. You should remain in this world forever. So yes. Soul of the lost, withdrawn from its vessel. Then strength be granted so the world might be mended. Soul of the lost, withdrawn from its vessel. Let strength be granted so the world might be mended. So the world might be mended. This is the Nexus. It holds together the northern land of Boletaria. But the five archstones will guide thee to the outer lands. You've died and the Nexus has imprisoned your soul. You cannot escape the Nexus. Well, you can't stop me. However, by capturing demon souls, you can reclaim your corporeal body. Through the fissure too, did you? You came for demon souls? Or to save this land and be remembered as a hero? <laughs> Hunting for demons? Try one of the arch stones. Now go. That is why you came, is it not? To this accursed Politaria? Bah, it's all the same. You're just another prisoner of the Nexus. We're welcome here. As long as we keep slashing up demons. <laughs> mm, you new here. Are you here for my services? The name's Baldwin. I'm just an ordinary blacksmith. It's simple. Just bring me all the souls you can. In trade, I'll give you weapons. Or forge the ones you already have. You're not Your that souls, ordinary then. I can eke out a living. And with my weapons, you can go on living. Not a bad deal, eh? How can I tell the price? Ah, uh, just 400 souls. Okay. Ah, uh, and a sharp stone shard, which I don't have. It's an edge sharpening stone. Cool. If you haven't heard, there's another blacksmith at the entrance to Stone Fang Mine. He's an eccentric old man. He knows his trade well. He's the only sane one left in a town of soul starved men. If you do meet him, no, forget it. That stubborn old native will just chase you off. Right. I'm gonna have to stop my computer from making noises. There okay. aren't enough smithing tools in this temple to handle all the work. Only certain ores can be used to forge weapons. But you'll just have to make do. And be thankful that I can do anything for you at all in this forsaken place. I'm Stockpile Thomas. When the scouts came, I didn't know what hit me. When I came to, I found myself. Here, in this nexus. My what I would be worthless in battle. Oh. At the very least, I hope to lend my assistance to you brave slayers of demons. This guy doesn't know like his mouth, I would be happy to lighten your load 
and look after any excess baggage. Hey. When the scourge came, I abandoned my wife and daughter and fled like a coward. When I came to, I was in this nexus. I haven't dared venture outside these walls since. I wish I could do more. But <laughs> I am ignorant of the world beyond these walls. Wait, where are you off to? Oh, I was curious about what was down here. Will the floor kill me? All their messages. Time for messaging. With no stamina, your shield defense is ineffective. When your stamina bar depletes, you cannot perform actions that consume stamina. There's a lot of messages. Okay, I'll read some of these there. Oh, that's interesting, actually. Sealed. Beware of thieves ahead. I don't think I, there's anything I can do there. Let's look up here instead. Enjoy the Nexus. Could be a bird. Could it? I've got durability, don't I? Don't even know if that's faster. I can run, can I? Little upvoting never hurt anyone. Up ahead. We shall continue further up. Not that way. Oh yeah, so I was going to say quickly. I I own the first game, and my brother, like, when this came out, he was ahead of a curve slightly, and he was like, nah, John, play this game, it's an amazing game, and I bought it just on his recommendation, and I don't even think I got to the Nexus, I just, I sort of played it and sort of went, ah, I don't really get it, don't really get, like, I barely gave it a chance, obviously I've got a, the new one, I'm playing a new one now, that's what's on the screen, but yes, what I'd show you, why not. I'm falling down. Yeah, I don't think so. I think I'll kill you. They really want me to fall down. Ah. Oh. Ah. Oh. 
Oh, no, that's why I'm falling down. Now I've done it. Teams are kind of interesting, aren't they? Uh... I shan't. I'm going in here. It's my profile! I still look silly. Why did I pick that character? I can still change it. I could do it off screen if I wanted. I mean, where? I barely started, right? Uh, but otherwise, I'll be here forever. Oh, look at that. What am I supposed to do right now? Maybe it was that side I just didn't know what to do on this screen. Castle in the heart of the northern kingdom of Boletaria. Hungary soldiers attack trespassers with their souls stolen by demons while nearby terrible dragons attack them from 